Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another mukbang. I am picking up a quick lunch, so I thought, why not film it and share it with you guys? Because I haven't done a mukbang in a little hot second. I know the setting is a little bit different. I am in my mom's car. My car is getting a whole bunch of maintenance done, so I am not in it. But this is my mom's little Jeep. Well, not little. She's big. She's, she's way bigger than my car. It's an old, old, old Jeep Commander when it first came out. Anyway, today I was craving pokey. I don't really, I hardly ever get pokey. I would much rather prefer eating sushi, but because I don't have access to my favorite sushi place right now, because they don't open until three, I thought I'd get pokey. This place is called Roll Rito. Um, I, hold on, let me get my phone so I can show you. Anyways, hold on let me let me share with you everything I got before I go into my whole story I'm I'm very if you couldn't tell I'm very scatterbrained today um what am I doing oh yes I'm pulling up the receipt I have in here brown rice sometimes I do mixed greens um so that you can kind of get like half half but I was hungry so I said brown rice only today then for my proteins, I got shrimp tempura, salmon, and shrimp. This is the medium. They also have a large if you, I don't know, want to share with someone or you are hungry, hungry. I don't, I don't blame you. Um, and then I got toppings, green onion, cucumber, cilantro, jalapenos. And then for sides, I got spicy, oh what? Oh, for my not dressing my sauce i got spicy poke sauce eel sauce and tangy avocado i've never had tangy avocado but it sounds really good because i love avocado and then for my sides i got spicy tuna spicy crab seaweed salad edamame ginger and then i added a little drizzle of sesame oil on the top it sounds perfection the medium poke bowl is $14.99 which is a pretty good price for like everything that you're getting i think this is like a perfect size if not more so I'm very excited anyways I'm gonna dig in because I'm starving and I have a water as well your four bucks I'm sorry this poke bowl is $14.99 and this water is four bucks what a scam I'm very excited I'm starving the shrimp tempura looks good. I am obsessed with seaweed salad. I always have been. My mom's been eating it since I was younger. Sorry if the cars are roaming and driving and whatnots. I'm parked right by a small street, so we're just going to deal. Anyways. Mm. Ginger is my favorite. This is a spicy crab. Mmm. Wait, hold on. I want a bite of my rice. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh, this is so good. When you don't have acid, access access to um sushi poke is like the best way to go this is definitely not authentic poke okay my gosh this, you mm, this is a lot of ginger and i'm really thankful but i just didn't really want that much Anyways, I never used to eat ginger when I was younger. Like, I used to eat sushi at a very young age. I think I was like, my parents tell me the story every time, but my parents were living, when I was little, like little, little, up to about four or five, I lived with my grandparents, like my whole family, not just my grandparents, like my mom, my dad, my aunt who is my dad's younger sister and then my grandparents we lived in like this big house and they would throw parties I don't know who it was but someone was throwing like a sushi party at our place and I came over at like four years old and was like what's that and then I tried it and it was like raw fish I loved it I've loved raw fish for like long long time but I didn't have poke until 
like my college no not even my adult life like I don't even think I had it before the age of like 23 what else was I saying oh ginger I never ate ginger when I was younger even though I ate sushi but my god it is my favorite now I really want to shimp, shimp tempura wow my English is just so good today I really wanted the shrimp tempura just to eat because I felt like it. Oh, this is like really hitting the spot, y'all. You guys know me. I'm going to do a little bit of top. Huh? You guys know me. I'm going to do a little bit of eating and then I'll get to talking, even though I already did a lot of talking. I also know poke is very, like, usually tuna-based. But I love salmon, so I get salmon. Mmm. You could mix it all together, but I like taking bits of, like, everything. And making, like, the perfect bite. Holy crap, this is so freaking good. Hello, I'm back from New York, by the way. Hmm. Okay, I did not think that poke was going to hit me this freaking good, but wow. Ooh, and their brown rice today is really good. Because sometimes, I hate when you get a poke bowl and the rice is so mushy. I hate mushy rice. I hate wet rice. Unless you're purposely trying to give me, like, rice porridge, like, chook or congee, like, things like that. I don't want wet rice. I want dry, separated rice. You know what I mean? If you guys are from California, or Southern California, specifically Orange County, please let me know if there's a bomb-ass poke place. I'd love to try. I love this place. It's clean. It's new. Not really new, actually. But it's close by. It's convenient. I order on Yelp. Which is technically Grubhub. Or DoorDash. I don't remember. Mm. The cucumbers are good too. Okay, you guys, 
I was clearly very hungry. My brother and I walked 12,000 steps yesterday at Disneyland. We didn't do the whole nine yards. We didn't go on specific rides. Um, we didn't get to go on all the rides. We only went on some of them, like the most important ones. Totally forgot that Indiana Jones was closed. Very upset about that because Indiana Jones is one of my favorite rides. Totally thought that Splash Mountain in California was closed. So when I saw people on it, I was like, oh my god, do these people have, like, VIP treatment? No. Turns out I'm stupid and did not read further. No, it was the Florida one closed. And does that mean that they're not doing the whole Tiana thing in California? Like, man, who cares about Florida? Just kidding. Did I eat all my salmon? Mm, mm, mm. I love edamame. I could eat it forever. Which is funny because I refuse to eat edamame at a sushi place. Like, I would put more money towards getting another roll than get edamame. Even though I like it. cannot wait to go back to New York. I miss Henry. I miss my cousin. Do I miss walking? No. But is my cousin and Henry worth that? Yes. 1000%. I want to say that she won't do it to me again, but Hedgen is a very outdoor person. Like, she loves being outside. We will most likely be going out a lot. Then again, when we're here, we're out a lot too. It's just, I have access to a car. You guys, I think this is the quickest mukbang I've ever done. Thank you guys for joining me. I'm trying to eat all the edamame and avoid the little piece of rice that's left. Little piece. Little. I'm really out of it, you guys. I'm. <laughs> I think it's because Disneyland was yesterday. And I'm just purely so exhausted. I don't think my brain's working. I can barely tell you if my whole body is working. I honestly am just alive to get my nails done because I'm that person. I broke a nail. There are certain things in my life that I just can't let slide. Having a broken nail is one of them. I have this, like, pimple on my nose that has been growing for, like, it has literally been, like, picking up the courage for the last, like, week to finally come out. And it came out, and it's so tiny. And it's, like, irritating. And I look funny. It makes my nose look funny because it's, like, bulging out on this side right here. little car 
Such a loud exhaust. Okay, you guys. I think I'm going to get, like, one more bite. Wow, that was really freaking good. Mmm. Wow. Gonna at the gonna eat the rest of the edamame. very good anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this very 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 quick mukbang but I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys next time bye